Hi, I'm Greg Smith. I'm from St. Louis, Missouri, and I had my VZ and ICO surgery at the St. Louis location at Brenton Vision. So it started off back in third grade was when I first had glasses or knew I had to get glasses. I realized I had to be extremely close to the board. So essentially I was near blind. Without glasses, I couldn't see maybe 15 to 10 feet in front of me. So they were kind of necessities, right? So when I would get up with, no matter what I would do, if it was going to the restroom or even going to get something to drink or water, I had to put my glasses on. So dealing with that for 20 plus years, it was very uncomfortable and it eventually got to a point where I was able to make a decision, make a choice, a life choice to, to actually improve the situation. And, and I did it. So some of the biggest challenges I have with glasses oftentimes will come from the glare. Since I work for an IT company, I'm constantly looking at a computer, right? Uh, the blue screen that we would get would kind of deflect off my glasses from time to time. I would constantly have to be cleaning them, uh, going from meeting to meeting as I try to present myself as the, the most reputable and presentable person possible. And oftentimes, uh, they just became a nuisance more than, uh, more than anything. What made me come to Brenton Vision, uh, to me it would have to be the opportunity, the, the knowledge that I was able to gather beforehand, and then the knowledge I was able to gather once coming here. I figured at that point uh, in my life, it was time uh, to make a decision uh, to better my eyes, right? And I figured after doing the research, the best people to help me out with that would be Brenton Vision. And I'd like to give special thanks to my optometrist uh, at that point who actually led me directly to the, to the company and the rest is all good. So when I got to Brenton, I must be honest with you, I was pleasantly surprised. From the, the intro staff all the way to, up to the doctors were very knowledgeable in terms of what I would need, uh, what was required of me, uh, from the, the level of surgery, the degree of difficulty of surgery, all the way up until uh, the recovery time. At each step along the way, there was someone there who basically treated you like family. Less about a business and more about a family connection. So, my vision now after the surgery, uh, I must say it's tremendous, uh, not to brag. Uh, right now I'm looking at about 2016 vision uh, after my post-op checkups. Uh, I have no blurry vision, I have no issues, but I'm telling you, once it happened, once I was finished and once I was past that post-op point, it's been tremendous. The one thing post-surgery that say, wow, like this is real life, is when I reached over on my nightstand and I realized, wait, I can see my nightstand and the time on it, and I didn't have my glasses. It was one of the best experiences I've ever felt in my life, considering I've been in glasses for 20 plus years at that point. So at this point, they're still asking, where are your glasses? I, don't you have glasses? And I tell them, well, I actually got surgery at Brent Vision, um, and I highly recommend it if you need uh, corrective surgery or you need to get rid of those glasses or contacts and you want a different change. Well, I'd like to give thanks to everyone here at Brenton Vision. Uh, they're awesome, everyone. I'm talking about the person, the first person that greets you when you walk in all the way up into the doctor, magical. It makes you feel like you're part of the family and I would highly recommend to anyone if you're looking to have uh, corrective surgery. Thank you.